We have 10 contestants, and the last one of you to talk wins $10,000. If you talk or make a noise, you will be eliminated. Every hour, we have challenges along with pranks and punishments that will make it harder and harder for you not to talk. Now, any last words? Starting now, it's game over. So what they don't know is, the mics that I gave everyone will actually tell me if anyone makes a noise. On top of that, we also have security cameras to make sure no one's trying to sleep. Because if they fall asleep, I will prank them, and these pranks will get them out. Turn that off! How's everyone doing? All right, it was worth a shot. I see some of you have come up with strategies on how you're gonna last longer than everyone else. However, covering your mouth is not allowed. Now everyone, let's head outside for the first challenge. For the first challenge, we're playing red light, green light. And you guys have one minute to cross the finish line if you don't want to face an extreme punishment. Green light. Red light. All right guys, remember, no talking. Green light. Red light. Red light. <laughs> you're out. <laughs> you're not eliminated from the challenge yet, but your punishment might get you to talk. Green light. <laughs> Green light. Red light. Green light. Red light. All right, ten more seconds. Green light. Red light. Green light. Dad, you have five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, you're out. If you don't want to do your punishment, all you have to say is no. But that would mean you're eliminated because you are speaking. <laughs> if you scream, you're also out. All right, Jeffrey, you're safe. In three, two, <laughs> Dad, you're out. Sean, are you ready for your punishment? <laughs> no, no, I'd rather eat ass. <laughs> all right, well, we just got two people eliminated. That hurt, I'm out. <laughs> I'd rather eat ass. We're down to nine contestants, and you guys have probably caught on by now that if you lose a challenge, you're gonna have to go through an extreme punishment that may force some of you to make a noise or talk. With that in mind, each of you has a balloon tied around your ankle, and the last balloon alive is safe from elimination. Go! Oh, God. Ah. Come on, Alex! Yeah, you got the Alex. Set. Oh my God, oh. everyone's keeping up on top! Oh! oh. Ah. Come on, Tanner, you got this, Tanner. Great! Out! Come on, Caleb! Chris! Out! I believe in you, Tanner. Oh. Oh. Hey. Out! Oh. The Indian power won't help you now! Oh. <laughs> Alex, out! We're down to the final three! Go! Tanner! Tanner! Oh. 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 Go, Tanner! Go, Tanner! Yeah, Tanner, go! Oh. Get Big boy went down. If you won the challenge, do you have anything you want to say? No? Okay, well it's worth a shot. You get to pick one person to go through an extreme punishment. Jeffrey, pick out. <laughs> you're picking Tanner? Tanner, you're not eliminated yet, but this punishment that you're about to go through might get you out. Let me punish him. All right, Tanner, you ready? Remember, if you scream, you're out. <laughs> We're three hours in, and three people have been eliminated so far. I also noticed that Crisp is asleep, so I'm gonna get a few people to help me prank and eliminate him. One, two, whoa, 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 what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, Chris, we all heard you talk, which does mean you're eliminated. So do I get nothing? I'll give you a thousand dollars if you go through a punishment. I'm down. Your punishment is the zip line of doom. <laughs> There's a second round? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I should have just gone home. 
For the third challenge, we're gonna be sumo wrestling. The last person remaining in this circle wins. In three, two, one, go! <laughs> Alright, five more left. Also, Caleb isn't competing in this because he won the last challenge. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Oh! Jeffrey! Oh! Alright, just four more left! Let's get ready to rumble! Hey! Everyone's teaming up on oh, the other! Up on oh, That's not fair! Oh, I'm eliminated! <laughs> We're gonna do the final three between Bates! You got him, Bates! Uh-oh! Oh! oh. 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 There it goes! Back against the corner! Come on, yeah! Yeah! Let's go, man! <laughs> Get a ring! Oh! Oh, oh, my God! Look out the ref! Look out the ref! Look out the ref! Oh! You were the last person remaining. You win a punishment. Your punishment is water torture. Oh. 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 All right, all right, guys, guys, guys. The first round was cold. This round's about to be hot. Welcome to the Reps Flaming Barbershop. No, <laughs> Hey, we weren't actually gonna do anything, but look, here's a thousand dollars anyway, and we did go easy on you, but from easy. here on out, the punishments are only gonna get more and more extreme. Now let's head back to the house. So I noticed everyone's on their phone playing games, and guys, no more phones. If I catch you on your phone, this is what's gonna happen. Now let's go outside for the next challenge. For the next challenge, you guys are playing tug of war. The losing team has to face an extreme punishment. Go! No talking! Come on! What is that, cat? I better not lose the tanner, team! Come on! Come on, Caleb! What are you guys doing? Pull! Pull the rope! Oh, yeah! Go Come on! Go on! Go on. Go on. Go on. Oh, yeah! yeah. The three of you might be wondering why you're in a trash can full of water, and that's because for your punishment, all three of you will be taking an ice bath. Three, two, one! You shouldn't have pushed me in sumo wrestling! No more! You guys make any noise, you're out! Like my son! Oh my god! 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 For the fifth challenge, you guys are going to be competing in a race. The last person to touch the end of that pool and come back will have to face a punishment so extreme that you're basically going to get eliminated. In three, two, one! I already know he's losing! Whoa! What's going on? Come in! Come in! Come on! 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 Come <laughs> One more lap! Oh, yeah, oh. Oh. You can't, you cheated! Well, technically you're safe because I never said you had to swim there. Come on, Tyler! Come on, Tyler! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come on, Tyler! What are you doing? Come on! Go, go, go. Caleb, you're smart! He's safe now! Come on! Go, go, go. Unfortunately, Tyler, you did finish last, so it's time for his punishment. You're gonna have to belly flop into the pool from all the way up there. In three, two, one! Oh shit! <laughs> Tyler, you were so close! I should've just not done it. <laughs> Before the next challenge, the first one of you to make a half court shot wins a thousand dollars. What the heck? Come on! This is it! Let's go! 
For this challenge, we're gonna be playing a game of dodgeball. And the plot twist is, it doesn't matter if you talk or don't, the losing team gets eliminated from this entire video. It's gonna be Team Jeffrey versus Team Allen. <laughs> Oh my, wait, we got one ball! Shit! That's a It's down to just one on one, and whichever team loses gets eliminated from the entire challenge. Finish it! Oh no, oh no, this is down. Yo, it's ah! Because you were the only real contestant on your team, you are the only one eliminated from the entire video. However, because you're a subscriber, here's some money. And talk about money. We actually spent over a million dollars in one of our last videos, which bankrupted us. However, a local bank agreed to reinvest a million dollars back into our YouTube channel, but that's only if we hit 20 million subscribers by the end of this year. So help us get there by subscribing. Thanks for being in the video and being a subscriber. Uh, but I'm not subscribed. What? I'm not subscribed. Oh, you f***ed up! Get the f*** out of here now! So we're down to the final three contestants, and for this next challenge, I hired a professional stand-up comedian to make you guys laugh. You guys can take off your blindfolds. So, I broke up with my cross-eyed girlfriend because we couldn't see eye to eye. Okay, okay, I know, that's kind of messed up. On a serious note though, we did break up because she was seeing another guy on the side. <laughs> Get it, because she's cross-eyed? <laughs> Come on guys, that's funny. I was just about to start the next challenge, and I noticed that Caleb actually fell asleep. So let's go wake him up with a prank. For the final challenge, you're both gonna be facing your fears. I'm gonna let a tarantula crawl on your face and you're not allowed to make a sound. Now, Kat, if you don't think you can handle this, you can speak up and say no. All right, put it on her. Oh my God, oh my God, it doesn't wanna go, oh my, it doesn't wanna go on her face. Oh my God, oh my God. All right, hey, now time to put it on Alan. I think this is the first challenge you've won, Kat. I know. What are you gonna do with the money? Spend it on you. On me? Yeah. I'm gonna get you liposuction to get rid of all that fat. What the hell, Kat? Huh? Ah, 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 me! Why is the chair rocking? Why is the chair rocking? And a body free to possess. Don't say that. Ah! Ah! It's locked. Um, it's locked. Do demons and ghosts exist? If you believe in God, then you have to believe in the opposite. Well today, we're gonna be doing a last to leave 100 hour survival at the scariest and most haunted place on earth, the Conjuring House. We also have the most expensive and accurate ghost equipment to help us detect paranormal activity. Whoa. Oh my god. Wait, this is the actual Conjuring House? Yes. And if you guys have seen the Conjuring movies, just know that this is the actual house that inspired them. Now, before we enter, just know that the last one of us to leave wins $10,000. And a possession. <laughs> Tanner? On a serious note, the two of us don't believe in this stuff whatsoever, but we are going into this with an open mind, and we're gonna do everything we can to find out if ghosts and demons are actually real for you guys. All right, now let's head in, guys. Hello. Hey, nice to meet you. Look, no one's here, dude. <laughs> no one's here. Ooh. Whoa. I definitely feel a presence in here. 
I don't think we're alone. Okay, you're just trying to make us leave. Okay, stop. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Before we officially begin the challenge, we wanted to give you guys a tour and backstory of just how creepy and paranormal this house is. Starting with the library. This is a really hot spot for paranormal activity when people come in for the night. There's a portal in this room that kind of aligns with the upstairs room. Should we just shut the doors here? They no. might open them on you, so. So these doors right here open and close by themselves sometimes. I have seen it myself, yes. After we toured the library, we moved into the living room where the original demonic possession took place. So this was the parents' um, dining room when they were here, and this is where the seance took place with the Warrens back in the day. What is a seance? Well, a seance is kind of a ritual used to communicate with the spirits, and something went wrong during the seance where something attached to Carolyn, the mother, spiritually. The table and chairs started to shake, her chair levitated, and she was thrown into the adjacent room next door. There was a lot so of witnesses she, to this. She got possessed. Correct. <sighs> and that might happen to us, you're saying? Because <laughs> 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 I'm leaving. Yeah. Yeah. After that. Dude, what? Okay. Why are you doing that stuff, dude? <laughs> ah, they do like to poke at visitors sometimes, so. Really? That's what happened to yeah. me. He's scared. Tanner's scared. Yep. There's bells here. Oh, are we signing the death oh, Look at this. Violent spiritual attacks. Electrical shock. Friction burns. Bruises. Scratches. Contusions. So, we have to sign this? They're literally saying this is going to happen to us. Violent spiritual attacks. No, stop, dude. What? Is that the ghost? <laughs> That's blood. While we were exploring the house, we heard a door randomly shut. Wait, wasn't that open just now? What? Yo. Yo. It was open earlier. Wait a second. Hey. Why is it closed? I mean, it is a haunted house. Oh my god, that is a creepy big bathroom. Come in here with me. Ah! 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 Did you guys hear that? What the? Is there like, someone I swear to God, I just heard knocking. Where did you hear it? Like upstairs, upstairs like dum 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 dum. Yeah, they do that. Why? <laughs> I'm not <laughs> leading the way. Like, yeah, shit. This ain't a bathroom. Oh, Lil, do you see the outside of the window? Oh hell. Yeah. Oh, it's just oh, a wall. Wait, it's just a wall. Oh my God. Hey, oh my God. It's guys, a secret wall. Guys, that's what they're doing. Holy sh! Do you guys see that? Is there there actually is a fucking shadow there, guys. Apparently, people were buried in the wall. That's where they hide the bodies. Yeah. Hey. Did you guys hear that? I heard, I, yeah. hey, I know I'm not the only that one. That was like a that. growl. For the record, no YouTuber has ever slept here overnight. We're actually staying here multiple nights. And we just found out that the longer you stay here, the more comfortable the demons and spirits get to haunt you. And I'm sure you guys know what happened to the original owners. <laughs> so just know that the longer we're here, the more difficult it gets for us to survive. Oh, I trip, I trip, I trip, I trip, dude. Don't fart in my face. Why would he do that? I've never done that before. Sean does if, that. If we did that, that would be a ghost dude and not us. Please. <laughs> Ain't no way. Ain't no way. I just heard knocking sound. Yeah, I just heard knocking that. sound, guys. I know you guys hear that. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ah! Fucking sh. I'm fucking leaving. I'm Ooh. fucking leaving. Ooh. 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 Why are they going down? The hell Why me? aren't Why? you scared? Why aren't you scared? Oh, oh my god! Okay, okay. Oh, okay. oh. Okay. You guys realize it's a haunted house, right? <laughs> yeah, I just, I never. On a serious note, though, I, I, I like your beard. <laughs> <laughs> this is the room you guys wanted to spend the night in. What? Oh, god. This is what it looks like. Wait, what is this room called? The boarding room. What? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, the door's actually locked. I'm not even joking. Oh, wait, it is locked. Oh my god, it is locked! Oh my oh god! Oh my god, it is locked! There we go, we're good. As we continue to tour, we quickly learned that the Conjuring movies did not do the place its justice. The real history of the house was actually 10 times worse than what the movies were allowed to show. Careful. You saw a shadow in here? Yes, I was trying to tell you guys. And you guys you saw a shadow in here. This room isn't haunted, right, or scary? This is the most active room for paranormal activity. Oh, this, oh, this is the most active room. Why am I in the front here. then? No, no, a lot of visitors here at the house will get nauseous, dizzy. Some people will have headaches. Time warps is kind of a thing in this room. We've had people claim to be here 10 minutes when reality an hour has passed by without them realizing it. Wow. Okay. Big ah! Ah! Wait, did it open? It when was, you did? Yeah, it just. Oh my god. Is this the room where the spirits would kiss the girls on the forehead goodnight and the girls thought it was the mom? Yeah. <gasps> yeah. As we entered the basement, we immediately noticed a very negative energy. No way! Whoa! 
This is the scariest basement I've ever seen. This is the well room. So it's a 10 to 15 foot well. Has anyone room. ever gone down that well? Yes. <laughs> oh, what is that? You see that? You, you see like that eyes. Eyes. Right here. Snake skin right here. Snake skin from shedding. They shed here, huh? Oh my god, dude, there's so much snake skin here, guys. Yeah. If I get scared, like, do I run to you or? Here. Where? Wait, wait are you gonna be here when we're sleeping? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah, what? so Sean's good. I'm just like, call <laughs> <laughs> After the owners left, it was time for the challenge to finally begin. So if you end up being the last one to leave, what are you gonna do with the $10,000? Probably get an exorcism. <laughs> <laughs> Before we actually get back into filming, like it is cold in here, uh -huh. right? Yeah. I'm not the only yeah. one. I, I, I think it's cold. That's not it. funny. I actually really believe in this stuff. I, I genu genuinely don't know how long I'm gonna last. I'm not gonna really. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> So we actually have a medium coming over later who has the ability to communicate with ghosts and she's gonna help us use our ghost equipment. But before that, we're gonna play a game of hide and seek and the first person found has to sleep alone in the basement. 60! Gotta find a good spot! 57! I'm hiding back here. Oh my god. Wait. Wait, we were just talking about this. This is where all the dead bodies are buried in the wall. I'm not hiding there. We're gonna go in the basement? I don't think they're gonna look in here. I'm gonna hide in here because it's pretty tiny. I'm gonna hide right in here. All right, ready or not, here we come, guys. So the real reason why we're both together is because you're actually more vulnerable to the spirits and ghosts when you're alone, so that's why we're the seekers. We're gonna check in here first. The basement first. Yeah, oh, uh, yeah. hey, if the lights are off, I'm not going down there, and I don't think anyone else is either. Dude, you keep sticking your butt in Yo, my face, man. Oh, this whoa. door's open, this door's open. Is someone in there? All right, boom, no one's in here. All right, I don't see anyone in here. All right, because I'm not going in there. Check back here, wait, I hear some. Wait, I hear something. Someone hiding back here? Hi, sisters! Ah! Is this James? The Why oh is the God. chair rocking? Why is the chair rocking? Um, there's no way anyone can fit in there. Is there someone in there? <laughs> oh, <damn. laughs> oh, oh my god! How did you guys find me? What is this spot? What do you mean? How do find I, I this could literally see you through the camera. It looked like you yeah. were taking a <laughs> dude. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were but hey, me. I got some good news. You were actually the last one found. Shut up. Yeah. No way. No, you're the first one found. You know what that means, right? You're having to sleep in a basement alone. No, I don't. Tanner, dude. you actually have to go sleep in a basement alone. You know I can't do that. Please, you have Alex, to. Please, Alex. Guys, we actually found the first person, so everyone's good to come out. After hide and seek, we experienced our first demonic encounter. We couldn't find Sean for half an hour, and then this happened. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you guys hear the rattling? Like someone's like trapped somewhere? What is what is that? Whoosh. Whoosh. Oh Sean? Sean. Are you guys here? Sean? Alex? Yeah? Oh, wait, what the Sean. Sean. That's just a seat. Wait. Are you sitting on this? No, I'm not. I'm actually not sitting on this. I actually this. can't push it out. <laughs> Ow! John, are you okay? What the heck? Oh. Open it. Yeah. Oh my god, wait, it is heavy. Wait, what the it felt heavy? like someone was on top of me. I was trying to get out like way early. It actually felt like two fat big booty bitches <laughs> were on me. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. No, but for real, no, no, honestly. Sean, so, like, get out of it. Just yeah, get out of it. Get out of it. No, no, no. You're freaking me out. Get out. Sean, just get out. Just stand up. What the hell? What the hell was that? You guys hear that? I know you guys heard Dude, that too. Yeah, I heard that. Do you not? No. Hey, I'm done. Uh, I'm out of here. Uh -uh. What do you mean? I'm out of here. You're out of here? You're leaving? Yep, nope. I can't be here. I'm scared. You can't leave. I am scared. You're not one of the contestants. We paid wait, you to be wait, here. Wait, hold on. Wait a second. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa, whoa. whoa. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, we hired you to film. It doesn't leave. matter. I'm not one of the contestants. I don't have to be here, so I'm leaving. No, this is. We're not, uh, hey, we're not paying you. I, you don't have to pay me. I'm going. Bye. Oh. That was probably so more weird I than that. <laughs> what? 
Okay, so I can't be too loud because everyone's downstairs right now, but now that Tanner knows where he's sleeping, we're gonna show Kat where she's sleeping, except we're gonna prank her first with the nun. Yo, 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 is that yo, yo. Hey, that actually went off by itself. That actually went off by itself. The spirits do not like you wearing that outfit. So before we actually prank Kat, please subscribe for our safety and like this video while you're at it because we're literally putting our lives on the line. Are you getting this? Stop. Did you hear that? Guys, the REM pod is going off, and the only way that can happen is if someone or something is touching it, which literally means there's a ghost messing with it right now. What did you bring with you? Why does that keep going off? I brought a REM pod. I'm setting it up right there. I also have this cross to keep me protected. I'm gonna set it in this chair. Mm. Okay. It's a good thing that you're not sleeping in the basement, but this room does have the most activity. out of my chest. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, you look scary. Don't look at me. <laughs> On a serious note, that REM pod going off, I don't know what that was about. There's definitely something else here. But yeah. good thing the medium is here, so we should go down and meet her. Okay. In case you guys are wondering, a medium is someone who can communicate with ghosts. And right now, we're gonna ask some questions we've always wanted to know. Can you please show me a yes? Show me what yes is. Do you see it going? Can you show me what no is? Can you see how it's moving in a different direction? Is there a demon by the name of Bathsheba here with us? Oh, that looks like a no. No, that looks like a yes. Wait, Whoa. the way it's swinging, it looks like a yes. Oh my god! Hey, right, oh. let's get out of here. Are there good spirits here? That's saying no. That's that's the no. Spirits, There's only bad right? spirits in here right now. Then why are That's we still in here? Is. Are there seven people buried on this property? I mean, yes, right? Yeah. Are they buried in the walls? That's also yes. He asked them if they were still alive, would they? No. <laughs> what? Would they date you? Yeah. <laughs> Not a yes. There you go. That's a soft yes. I didn't get rejected by a ghost. <laughs> so between three and four a.m. is the thinnest veil between here and there, and the more we approach Halloween, that's when it's at its extreme thinnest veil. So we came so, at the worst time. The best time for spirit communication. Oh, look at the handprint there. Oh my Whoa. God. Whoa. Wait, that's a handprint? Yeah. Sean, it's not tickling me. Sean. I'm over here so that someone else is tickling you. Give me them balls. So during witch an hour, we actually all decided to go to Bathsheba's graveyard and hopefully encounter with some spirits there. Oh, is that it? Why are we here? Why are we here? If we see something like someone else here, are we running or what do we do? No, we're not running. running. We're not running. Are we fighting? No, we're not doing what the hell are we doing? We're not hey, doing Kat's no. gonna run. Tanner's gonna run. Tanner's gonna, <laughs> gonna trip again for us. <laughs> Oh my god, I swear to god I just heard something new. I'm not joking around. Honestly, I think Bates made the right call leaving this early. Uh, we, we shouldn't be here. I don't think I'd be able to stay here that much longer. What's that? Ooh. Stop. What's that? that? What's that? Uh, uh, Shh. Stop. What's that? I don't know if I could do this. Well, this was a bad on. idea. You guys can't be here! <laughs> 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 All right, so we finally found Bathsheba's tombstone, and right now we're gonna try to communicate with her. We also set up a REM pod back here, so if you see the light go off, that means it's her spirit or another spirit trying to communicate with us. What's going off? What's going off? So it's still witching hour, and we're gonna use a spirit box that allows spirits to communicate with us using radio frequencies. Are you here with us right now? <laughs> I yes, I heard yes. yes. I heard, I heard yes. yes. I heard yes. Are you an evil or good spirit? I heard evil. I heard evil. I heard evil. I heard evil. Devil. Devil. I heard devil. I heard devil. Are you going to haunt us? No. No. I heard no. No. I heard no. I heard no. We come to you with a peace offering and a body for you to possess. Don't say that. Rock, paper, okay. scissors, guys. The loser has to stay tonight here, okay? Rock, okay. paper, scissors, shoot. Mm. Oh, oh, you guys have to go you now. Guys do you, too. you guys have what to do go. You mean? The loser of you guys has to stay tonight here. Go. Oh, go. hell no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're going down, <laughs> 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 
She said she was evil. You can't you it's not Brian, I'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> if you leave, you're technically out of the challenge. So it's up to you, Zach. All right, Zach. Good luck, Zach. Bye, guys. Bye, Bye Zach. <laughs> When we got back to the house, we learned that we weren't allowed to sleep under the covers. Your best bet is to just lay right in the middle of bed and not move the entire night. Because you were the first one found in hide and seek, you're gonna have to sleep in the basement. I'm sorry. Good night. And the reason why I'm giving you a hug is because tomorrow when you wake up, you're gonna wake up a different person. No. I just say that. Can one of you guys come down there with me? Oh, you're not gonna be down there alone. Trust me on that. Your spirit's down there. Right, let's do it. Oh my um, god, I did not expect that. Yeah, let's go down. Alright, let's go down. Alright, good luck, Tanner. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if I can do this. I think I saw something over there. What the hell? What the Holy I think I just might leave, dude. Wait, they, they locked the door. I can't leave. You know, I'm having a panic attack. All right, so Sean, you're actually gonna sleep next to the birthing room in here, and Kat, I'm gonna have you in the room next door. I'm about to get someone pregnant. What? <laughs> what? Let me try to go to sleep. And I actually forgot to mention this earlier. We're down to only six people now. And one thing that we're both really terrified about is the kids who slept in this room claimed that there were ghosts that would tell them goodnight and kiss them on the forehead. They thought it was their own mother doing it until they noticed the mother smelled like roses while the ghost smelled of a really foul stench. If I feel anything tonight, I'm actually leaving. I'm not putting up with that. Yeah. A blanket. This is getting way too weird for me. I am leaving. God. So we survived the night. We're officially on day two. I actually felt tugging. You guys hear that? I know you guys just heard that. It is pretty early, and I do think we are the first ones up. So I say we prank someone with a nun again. The microphone just went out and that's never happened before. Like it was working two minutes ago when we were outside. The ghosts have been known to siphon energy from electronics. We think that's actually what's happening right now. So this is the second time I'm doing this intro now, but our friends are really scared and to make them even more terrified, we're gonna prank them by making them think they saw something. <laughs> that wasn't me. That was a ghost. How'd you sleep, Tanner? I didn't sleep. You didn't sleep? Not one bit? I don't know. I thought I kept seeing something over there. I kept looking over there all night. I'm surprised you haven't left because I would have left. I almost left when I, when I first went down here, but I couldn't because the damn door was locked. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, bro. Let's actually just go. No. What do you mean, no? I swear to God. Are you saw stupid? I just saw something. Shut up. You guys saw too. I, I saw someone just walk that way. I'm not going back over there, dude. I just have a fucking heart attack. Alan, I'm going to have a panic attack again. Yeah, the camera yeah. battery kept dying down here. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm actually out. I can't do this anymore. I almost had a fucking panic attack as you guys, dude. We can leave now. Like, we can leave the basement now. You no, can. no. I'm leaving, leaving. You're leaving. Like, leaving. I'm getting an Uber to the airport and I'm <laughs> fing out. Why? I almost died over there. So, how did you guys sleep last night, Kat? Uh, terrible. I kept getting the sensation like someone was staring at me. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, well I, I didn't sleep that much, you know. I, I did more so like protecting you guys. Protecting? How are you protecting us? Just watch the footage. <laughs> I was actually looking looking over you guys. What the hell happened, Sean? 
Oh, and uh, Zach left. Just got to the airport, and I literally bought the first flight out of here. And I assume I'm gonna be reimbursed for the ticket. So that means we're down to just the four of us. I say we split up and we each go to a room that had the most activity yesterday, except we go by ourselves and see if it's scarier. Kat and Sean wanted to communicate with the spirits peacefully, but we had something else planned. I don't know why they thought this was a good idea, but I'm ready to make a communication with the, with the children. Do you want to become my friend? Sure. Sure! sure. Are you next to me? I, it says behind me. Should I, should I run or stay? You Is it run? Yeah. Yeah? Actually, I'm actually really scared right now. Are you inside the birthing room? Yes. <gasps> yes? I heard yes. yes. I gotta go inside. The birthing room? I'm sorry. Mom. I saw something down my spine. It's just Alex. <laughs> Are ghosts always white and translucent? No. Do ghosts like to be filmed? That one said I do. <laughs> you scared me so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> I waited outside 10 minutes for that. <laughs> So we have some more paranormal investigators coming over for the second night and it's actually just down to the three of us now because we haven't seen Sean for a long time. Yeah, where's Sean? I'm back and fully protected. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, I think that's a little excessive, right? I'm winning this challenge. <laughs> <laughs> All right, if anybody's in this room or in this house and you can hear my voice, I'm asking you to come into the room, please. And when you get right here, I'm gonna ask you to stop walking for a second. Stop in place. Give me, let's say, four loud stomps wherever you are. One, two, three, four. Thank you so much. Were you in the closet earlier? Oh, 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 the rimpod's going off. Can you set off the rim pod again? Oh, oh my, my god. god! Oh my, my god. god! Hey, that's the first time the rim pod's ever been set off when we asked the spirit to set it off. After the paranormal investigators left, we decided to head into the basement to communicate with the spirits for witching hour. But then this happened. Guys, we came downstairs during witching hour to try to film another scene. And it is saying, please charge the battery when the battery was fully charged. Are you? Are you freaking kidding me? The second we replaced the battery, it's still going off. Do you hear it? If there is a spirit here with us, can you please leave the REM pod alone? Uh, guys, if alone. it's going off like that, then it means actually someone's touching it. Now keep, keep it on it, keep it on it, keep it on it. Oh my goodness. Why is it going off like that? Something guys, right there. Should we get help, guys? As we said earlier in this video, the longer we stay here, the more comfortable the spirits get to haunt you. Okay, we should, we, let's start this. I think this is the best time to start it. I can't hear anything. You guys ask the questions, okay? Is there a spirit down here with us? Did you see that? Yes. Did you see the thing turn red? Alan, hey, I can't hear you guys. Do you see it? All the way. Oh Five. Gosh. All the way. Do you want to harm us? Possibly. Hey, I keep seeing that thing go off. Every time I answer a question, that thing goes off. Guys, we're not faking this. We're it's going off again. Why is it going so crazy? Because it's witching hour and we're in the basement right now. Why is it doing that? If there's a spirit here, could you please stop touching the rim pod? It just stopped. Yes, it actually just stopped. Thank you so much. What do you want with us? Hurt. No, no. Stop. Pan over, pan over. Why? Do you want to harm us? The rim pod's going off. Why do you want to harm us? 
Get out. Okay. Get okay. out. Okay. All right. Hey, I'm not you know joking. What? I just heard. Hey, get out. That's what I just. Oh my god. Ah! I chill. I just found a chill. Me Freaking out. me out. Hey guys, listen. It's going off. Guys, it's going, it's going off again. again. Okay, listen, listen, listen. So, what do you guys think we should do? What do you guys think we should do? At this point, we all wanted to leave, but we owed it to you guys to stay longer and investigate. I'm actually starting to believe in this kind of stuff. What is your name? Oh. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. What is your name? Bathsheba. Okay. Oh. Hey, that's the hey. She's she from the grave. It's from the grave. All right. It's you know from what? the grave. I'm scared to leave. I'm scared to walk past this. What was that? What was that? What was that? What was I that? Felt something what, was that? what was that? What was that? What was that? We're not joking around, no. guys. We were supposed to leave way like, earlier. Like the plan was to leave way earlier, but this the is... fact that there's so much activity down here, compared like compared to last night, are you mad at us? Maybe. Can we make a peace offering? We leave him behind. Let's go. Run! Run! Okay. Run! Let's run! Let's say run. Hey, hey, I'm not joking. I just heard run. I'm not joking. I heard run. I swear to God, then I heard let's run. Go. I, heard, I don't care about the ten thousand dollars. We're leaving it as a peace offering. Mother, mother Hey, can someone come with me? Someone get near me, guys. Get come with me. We're right here. Let's go together. Come on, mother. And her rampods are going off. Rampod is going me, off. Me, 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 me first. Whoa. Hey, look at me. Oh, she has a phone. Everyone come back. It's locked. It's locked. Hey, guys, it's actually locked. Okay. Um, and we're all down here. Uh, we're the only ones in this house. Only people in this house. So that means a spirit. Can lock this down here, guys. Why does this open? It just opened. Why does this open? Well, then let's go. I'm hey, we're oh. leaving our suitcases here. I don't care. Whatever we took here, we are not leaving with it because I don't want to bring that energy or any spirit with us. What? We should have never filmed this video. What? What? Whose idea was this? 